All right, hey, just want to do an update on the lithium battery that I've been running. I probably put about 15 hours on the motor since last week. Posted the other video, went up to the Trinity River, did some fishing. Check it out. Look at this haul. And uh, <clears throat> the battery did great. When I got there on the first night, I was by myself. I actually had all of my interior lights on. And uh, I'd kill the motor, get up there and set a line. It'd take three or four minutes. And I got a light bar, two side lights, and then some really dim interior lights right here. And uh, went back here. Motor started fine. I never turned the lights off for, I don't know, 45 minutes. I only set out a few lines by myself that evening. But... The rest of the weekend, Friday night and Saturday night, I ran all the lights all the time. Was running the motor, you know, majority of the time when that was going. But uh, anyhow, it is doing great. And I've been reading the instructions here. And really the biggest no-no, it seems, is you just don't want to... It says uh, no more than 15 volts. Don't charge it more than 15 volts. And this does not do that. I put it on my vessel view. I actually forgot the exact number. It's 14-something. So feel good about it. Uh, there were some concerns that came up in the last video about how Mercury, Yamaha, I think most outboard manufacturers don't recommend running lithiums. Uh, I've kind of don't care. I guess mainly because it's just one more thing that they can avoid a warranty worth and make you pay for something. Something totally irrelevant went wrong. Um, but that's me being a conspiracy theorist. But anyhow, that's the update on the battery. I like it, bottom line. I get to now use my little Walmart battery, which I don't even have it in the boat anymore, for my big bait cooler. I put a 12 volt Mr. Bubbles on it for transporting bait and stuff like that. So that's saving me weight as well because I used to use a big deep cycle battery for that for all weekend use. So anyway, I did bring my chainsaw. Try to get these deep east Texas rivers cleaned up a little bit. I actually won't be down here long before I end up going back up north to the house, so who knows, but that's it. I'd run a Rithium without even questioning. Never have I them caught other three. Boys, them other boys may be up there fighting. Yeah. Too. I've never caught three flatheads on one line. That's why you throw a five hooker. He's going to push 30. Uh, almost 20, maybe 20.